Welcome in second part of DIY Drummer CNC. Today we'll assemble the frame, but firstly we have to cut some parts. When it hits you, yes, 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 you shall. When it hits you, yes, 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 Here is a small package that was holding me back from assembling DIY Dremel CNC. I faced some problem with shipping company called Impost because they lost my package and I was waiting for them to find it, but they didn't find it and after almost a month I decided to order the same parts again but this time I decided to use DHL as shipping company and after two days here I have my package without any problems. Thank you DHL! and shame on you in post. Before we start assembling I want to quickly explain you what I did to prepare those parts for assembling and what you saw at the beginning of this video. Firstly I cut aluminum profiles with a saw. Shorter one is 30 cm long and longer one is 60 cm long. Linear rods were cut with angle grinder because they are made out of steel and you can't cut that with a hand saw. Then with a drill I rimmed out holes on the sides of shorter profiles to taper thread inside them. I also drill out holes on the sides of longer profiles to connect them with screw to shorter ones. To drill this hole in proper place, I print out a small part that positions the hole exactly 10mm from the edge of the profile. Of course this is not a perfect solution, because you can drill out this plastic part, but it is good enough for that. I hope that explains how I prepared these parts for assembling. If you still have any questions, please ask them in the comments below. And now let's start assembling. When it hits you, yes, 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 you shall. When it hits you, yes, 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 When it hits you, yes, 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 you shall. When it hits you, yes, 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 you you holler, yes, one, two.
for Dremel CNC is ready in just 5 minutes, but seriously it took me 4 hours to assemble it. But most of that time I spent on moving a camera and recording it, so you should easily do it in 2 hours. As for now, machine seems to be really rigid, but there is one problem with Z-axis carriage. I grinded out holes for bearings a little bit too much, so it's not that rigid, you can feel some loose and I have to fix that. I already tried to fix that with hot glue, but that's not a good idea, so I have to come up with something else. As for now, I don't know how to fix that, so I will do that later. There was not a lot of problems with assembly, but you should be more gentle than I was because I broke some 3D printed parts. I'm really proud of my CAD design. Everything fits so perfectly and looks awesome. I will put links to STL files, parts and tools that I use down in the description. Let me know in the comments what you think about my machine and don't forget to subscribe to don't miss the third part of DIY Drummer CNC will assemble the electronics and upload program to the Arduino. Thank you very much for watching, happy making, bye!